Hi, this is Sebastian from NEAT and welcome to another session of NEAT Presents. Uh, today we're in our Oslo office and besides me I have our beautiful NEAT board. And today I want to talk about auto framing. We've added the feature, you know, the auto framing where we can track individuals in the room, but there might be scenarios where you don't want everyone to be tracked or, you know, framed. You might be walking into the room, you might want to limit it for a couple of seconds, you might be in an open area. In one of our latest updates, we've added a feature called boundaries. What the boundary feature will allow you to do is set a parameter of where the camera will be tracking individuals. So um, I'll show you how you can turn this on on your device at home. So on our neat board, you can then navigate into system settings. Um, you will be asked to enter your Zoom room passcode. I'll just enter that for us. And once you're in the system settings, we'll navigate to audio and video. When you scroll down, you'll see the subject boundary option. Once we enter into this, we can then play around with what the camera is seeing. It will give, it will give us some info on what is being tracked and what is being framed. So let me go jump into this. So as you'll see, you get a full overview of what the camera is seeing. You have green squares around the people. And if say, we want to limit, so Christina is no longer framed, we'll cut it down to say three feet or one meter range. So then you can see I'm green squared and then Judah and Christina are red. And this is what you can play around with. So if we look out of this, this setting is now set, so when I jump into my next call, we have the boundary set, and we can kind of control who's framed during that call.